season four is here and it's bigger than I thought. Let's go look at everything new in the most exciting season ever. Get the battle pass. Wait, I gotta use the code tomato first. Uh, you, you should do this right now. I didn't even look at it. I just bought it. Scoped burst SMG. What is this? Welcome to Fortnite season four. Today, I'm gonna tell you everything new. And we're starting off at one of the brand new POIs, Eclipsed Estate. And we already found a new shotgun, the Infiltrator Pump Shotgun. Okay. It's got fast fire rate. I don't hate it. We'll have to see it in action. Twin Mag Assault Rifle. Whoa, hold on. That's got a really cool green dot thing. Anyways, I've got so much to talk about. This update is huge. Oh, I found a new tent. This is a heist bag. The heist bag offers an uncommon or rare weapon, two consumables, and a heist tool such as a rocket ram or explosive. Oh, I could have got a rocket ram from that. Oh, don't worry, there's more. Come on, give me the rocket ram. No. So this gives me huge agency vibes. Sadly, it's not. Chill. No, no, you don't have to do that. Oh, anyways, I got a rocket ram. Let's try it out. That just broke my PC. Oh, chill, 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 what? Bro, <laughs> who is this? Dude, this place is scary in a good way. I'm gonna go through the battle pass in a little bit later on in this video, but for now, I've gotta just explore everything. All right, I'm gonna rocket ram this turret. Take this, noob. That's really cool. When you don't lag, it's actually awesome. Crash pad junior? Oh, it's a cute little crash pad. That's adorable. Uh, uh, there's a boss down here. I'm gonna die to it for sure. Hey, fr it's, it's him. It's, is that, is that Kato Thorne or whatever his name is? How do you go through this without dying? There's three new POIs, the Eclipse Estate, Sanguine Sweets, and Relentless Retreat. I'm gonna show off all of them really quick. I'm getting shredded by NPCs. Let me just, uh, not what I meant to do. Low card? <laughs> That's funny. Take this, low card. Tell me that's not the coolest thing you've ever seen ever. Oh, we got a business turret. This is a new location. Let's use it on the boss. Did I say new location? I meant item. It's early, guys. It's 7 in the morning. The business turret is out. And the business turret shoots out of a... Okay, it's dead. So, honestly, not the easiest location to get into the vault. So... Let's see what's in there. That is Kato Thorn. Okay, cool. And he drops Thorn's scoped burst SMG, a mythic weapon, and of course, the estate vault key card. These turrets hurt so bad, bro. And in this vault, we have. Whoa, this is way bigger than I thought it was. Oh, 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 oh. guys. <laughs> Steel Midas' drum gun. So this guy's been holding the old OG mythic weapons. There's also four epic chests. This is gross. So you put. Oh, oh no. No, I wanted my this drum gun, bro. Okay, so you can only take one, but then you have to like escape, I guess. I don't, everybody comes to attack us. Oh no, this is sick. This is like a whole new video game. Okay, let's get out of here and then I can tell you guys everything about all the new stuff. All right, really quick. I want to see how bad these lasers hurt just for testing. Oh, um, <laughs> so they don't hurt, but they lock you in, which is not good. Okay, we got out, now I can finally talk. So, new loot. We got the small crash pads that I showed off, the business turret, the rocket ram, the pump shotgun, the scoped burst SMG, and the twin mag AR. I've gotten all those so far. The only thing I haven't gotten is the brand new shock grenade. So I'm looking forward to trying that out. But not only do we have a bunch of new loot, we also have a bunch of unvaulted loot. We've seen a lot of them already, but Midas' drum gun, TNT's bow, Ocean's chug jug, Kit's Charge Shotgun, Kit's Shockwave Launcher, Zig and Choppy's Ray Gun, and the MK7 AR. So the fact that all these mythics are unvaulted makes me think that at these three different vaults across the map, there's three random old mythic weapons, which is awesome. So with everything being unvaulted, we've had a bajillion things that were vaulted. Just really quick, like no one cares. Havoc's gone. The lever action's gone. Blah, blah, blah. Kinetic Boomerang's gone. Flapjack's gone. Yeah, whatever. Man, it's gone, sadly. There is a new car called the Fang Vehicle, so I'll show that in a second. We've got a weird tower here, and also people guarding this tower. 
Oh, oh, oh no. I wasn't ready for a fight. Luckily, this AR is, or this SMG is disgustingly good. Take that, low card. And then who's this? This is... I'm dead. It's the dealer. And the dealer drops a golden twin bag and a forecast access card. Let's see what the weather's like. Forecast available. Oh, that's cool. Oh, you can see all the future storms. That is a cool idea. We've got 11,000 new augments. Let's talk about them. Ammo drop to instantly gain ammo. Fast fisher to increase your swim speed. Like, okay. Explosive surplus, gain rocket ammo. Cool, cool, cool. Pistols have reduced fire rate, but increased damage. Yeah, these are boring. I'll talk about more in a second. High Vader. High voltage. Instantly gain a business turret and shield breaker EMPs. That is not boring. That's cool. Snipers give siphon on hit? That's also cool. Never mind. Augments are insane this season. Lonely Labs has been replaced with a much cooler place. Sanguine Sweets. Say that five times fast. Hello, low card. I love how they have, like, zero health. They're so satisfying to kill. Okay, so this has a similar vibe to the last area, but I wonder who the boss is. And I wonder what mythic weapons they have. This twin mag AR, kind of really satisfying to use. Let's try out the pump shotgun. Oh, hey. What? What? This is, like, oh, it's an invisible wall. <laughs> I was about to say, this new shotgun's trash. Boom! I like the fire rate of this new shotgun. Ooh, business turret. Take this. Oops. Get the turret. Okay, so this guy drops the Diamond's Thermal AR. I mean, DMR. And also a new... Dude, there's so many mythics. Turret out of range. Turret will self-destruct. No. Oh. Okay, so. Yeah, I was right. So each vault has... I don't know if it's random each time or if each vault has these set locations, but this one's got the MK Alpha and Zig and Choppy's Ray Gun. Well, I'm definitely gonna take the Foundations Gun and let's skedaddle. Honestly, the design in these new POIs is crazy good. Good news, I found a new car. This is the Fang. Woo! It sounds sick. Oh, okay. It sounds awesome. It can drift, it's pretty fast. Oh. I'm bad at driving, but these are awesome. All right, let's actually check out the battle pass. The first person, Nolan Chance. All right, tactical <laughs> Nolan Chance. Piper Pace, hyperspace Piper Pace. Say that five times fast. Fish Thick, everybody's favorite. This kid is awesome. I cannot wait to unlock this. Great name, by the way. Whoever came up with that deserves a race. <laughs> We've got May. I like her outfit. We've got... Cooler May. Antonia. Scary Antonia. Reminds me of that old boss. And then, of course, Kabi Lame, the TikToker. Do I know why they added him? No. But he's cool. And then, of course, Kato Thorn, a ferocious traveler. Yeah, whatever. Oh, he's a vampire. Also, you can unlock Ahsoka from Star Wars in like a month. Solid battle pass. Make sure to use code TOMATO, please. Like, just... That thing right there. Sadly, there is no Midas this season, but I have a feeling that he will be back. But honestly, even though there's no Midas, Kato Thorn is an awesome replacement. So far, the bosses this season actually have some meaning and feel really cool. A small change, but Fortnite adjusted the storm timings. I'm just gonna put them on the screen right now. It seems like the first storm is longer, but then after that, it's shorter and shorter. And welcome to the final POI, Relentless Retreat. This looks like a great spot to just hang out. Too bad there's henchmen everywhere. Hey, don't mind. Whoa, 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 whoa. New shotgun kind of reminds me of like a combination between a pump and a drum. Is that, if that makes sense? All right, who is this? I appreciate that the bosses have less health this season. I don't have to spend 3,000 years trying to get them. So this is Hearts Dealer. He drops Hearts Have Expressed. And of course, another key card. That's definitely the least cool boss. Just gonna throw that out there. Okay, let me just... Ugh. Let me just... My head definitely hit that, but it's fine. Here we are. Oh, okay, so it's definitely random because the foundations was at the last one. That's really cool. Ocean's bottomless chug jug. So this evil, stupid guy, Kato Thorn, is a vampire who steals people's mythics. Not cool. Actually, it is really cool because that means we get to use... 
the mythics. So it is random as to which mythics are at which location, but I will point out that Kato Thorne's place, Eclipse Estate, has three instead of two. And I believe, ow, I believe that's everything. Let me check my notes. Oh, I didn't get the shock grenade yet. Overall, I think this new season is awesome. Let me know what you think down below. Use Go Tomato, and uh, I'm gonna go make a bunch of videos.